Good afternoon, everyone. This is Henry, and as we get into the free video for tonight, I wanted to begin by looking at the advanced decline, because this is part of what helped me set up this trade, and it occurred really about the middle of the day. So when you get the beginning of the session, you get a very positive start to this reading. As you progress through the morning, you never take out the low of the day, which is just to say that advancers continue to stay on pace, outpacing decliners, and that will give you, most of the time, a bullish tendency towards the end of the day. So right around 11.30 central time was when I decided to put this trade idea on, possibly better reflected through the cash index, but with this big focus or, you know, big opportunity in trading the zero day expiration options, that's what we were looking today for the SPX idea. So again, just a little bit before lunch, I put that on and people have different ways of trading the SPX end of day idea. To really make it work for you, I believe you have to use strategies that offer excellent risk reward and take advantages of the unique nature of the product. One of the most unique things about SPX is that it is cash settled, so you don't have to worry about there's no way to get shares into your account. So with this cash settling, I kind of like the idea of pushing the position, letting it go through expiration to see if I can get it to certain strikes. So again, about midday, we decided to put on the 3900 unbalanced butterfly. And since it is cash settled, I feel more comfortable selling a put option that is deep in the money. So we initiated that with the short 3900 when the S&Ps were trading around 3886, give or take. We were able to take in a two and a half dollar credit, which doing the five dollar wide unbalanced butterfly for a two and a half dollar credit gives you a maximum potential profit of $750, but as it worked out, and you just use the settlement price now that the markets are closed, I would look at this and say 3902.62. So you just break it down a piece at a time, and you say at that price, the 3895 put is worthless. The 390 put, the 3900 put, that is worthless. The 3905 put, and that is worth uh, $2.38. So you take the 250, add it to the 238, and you can, you know, you end up with a pretty nice trade. So I would just have you consider those unbalanced butterflies and cash products as an excellent way of participating in these markets and a good strategy to have in your toolbox as you pursue uh, this product. So I hope that's helpful. You guys have a great rest of your afternoon and I will see you in the next free video. Hey traders, this is Henry with simplertrading.com. I wanted to thank you for watching today's video. I hope you found it helpful. And if so, be sure to click the like and subscribe buttons down below. If you would like to also see me putting these ideas into action and trading my own account live in front of you, be sure to sign up at simplertrading.com and I hope to see you in the chat room sometime soon.